The Vince McMahon documentary was a severe disappointment. This documentary was not meant for wrestling fans. This was not meant for people who's been watching wrestling for the past 5, 10, 20 years who already know these stories about Vince McMahon. Wrestling is in another boom period and this documentary was made for those people who just started watching wrestling that know nothing about what happened. They advertised this thing like it was going to be the most scathing review of Vince McMahon's life yet, and it basically was a recap of everything we already know. What it looks like is that this was supposed to be a documentary celebrating Vince McMahon, and it still was a documentary celebrating Vince McMahon. They tried to make it seem like they were against him by saying he's the same as the Mr. McMahon character. That was nothing. Other wrestling news pages tried to make a big deal of the fact that Stone Cold don't believe in CTE. Listen, humans tend to believe that if it didn't happen to them, then it's not real. So Stone Cold, the fact that he only ever had one concussion, so he says, it's understandable that he would believe that CTE doesn't exist. But the fact that Vince McMahon hit up Chris Nowinski and asked him to do more research on this shows that even though Vince McMahon is denying it, he knows that it was true and he actually took measures to protect his wrestlers. Unless you're new to the wrestling world or need a refresher, don't watch this documentary. You're just going to reiterate the same stories that you already heard a million times over. Montreal Screwjob.